Support efforts for human trafficking survivors is expanding in Macomb County. The nonprofit Turning Point has announced a new shelter and additional apartment units to help survivors start a new life. Megan Woods gives us insight on why this is so critical in Turning Point's mission. The new 27 bed shelter came as a gift and will allow Turning Point to change more lives of human trafficking survivors, not just in Macomb County, but across the country. It happens in Macomb County, Oakland County, Wayne County, <laughs> outlying counties, it's everywhere. Dr. Sharman Davenport, president and CEO of Turning Point, says the nonprofit takes in local and out of state labor or sex trafficking survivors. Having a place for them to stay other than a hotel is critical. The lack of housing is an extreme barrier to survivors, right? If you don't have anywhere to go, <laughs> um, where you feel safe, where you, you, know, you can take your children, and know that they're going to be safe, um, chances are you're really not going to leave the situation. So additional shelter is an answered prayer. Recently, we were uh, contacted by a local church in Macomb County, and they said that they had renovated a home and um, created nine bedrooms uh, with three you know, at least three beds each. All Turning Point has to do is provide the staff to run the home. Then, thanks to a grant, the organization can add 12 apartment units to the eight they already have. Survivors will be able to stay in their own apartment, which we furnish and pay for for up to two years while they work on um, creating the changes that they need to stabilize their life and become self-sufficient. There are ways for you to help, from donating gently used clothes or furniture to volunteering. For more information, visit clickondetroit.com. In the newsroom, I'm Megan Woods, Local 4.